Hello, people. How's it going? Welcome back. Apparently, Poland wants to do things with us. That's always wonderful. I like you, Poland. I'll do things with you. And welcome back to Hawaii. So last time we were kind of steamrolling towards uh, Moose Jaw, Regina, and uh, the areas in between. And uh, I probably actually uh, might attempt to take Saskatoon. We'll see what happens. Um... I guess we'll fight them with my Air Force? I don't know. We'll see. Again, we'll see what happens. The Air Force up there could just attack me um, when I go after Moose Jaw. That's also a very... Uh, it's, it's a possibility, that's for sure. So, definitely something to take into account. So, yeah. Also, they're building a land f or, uh, aircraft fabrication up in Cold Lake, which um, I don't like, so go away. Get out of Cold Lake... Man, it's not its not befitting of you. I'm going to see if I can cut that off. Let's see if the Americas will give me any more supply. Probably not, but you never know. Stuff and things. My phone just went off. Sorry, I had to, che I had to check to see what the hell it wanted. Sometimes it wants stuff, sometimes it doesn't at all. There, see if the Americans will uh, feed our supply chain a little bit better. Um, does that research center actually um, take away military? I think it does. Oh, let's cancel construction, we'll scrap it for now. If we need one, we'll build another one later. What are we at? 2582. And have we activated that land fabrication? We have... That is very good. We have two more there. Okay. And then uh, those will be finished. Am I going to build more? Uh, probably. Uh, we do need more units. We're at what? 30? 33. That's not very high. Uh, we need at least... I want at least 100 units before I even... Um, before I even think about going after anybody at all. So, <laughs> yeah. That's how many units I require before I try anything uh, at the capital and go any farther than Thunder Bay. Because after Thunder Bay, we're probably going to have to come through America, which means I will probably either enter through Windsor or I'll enter through Sarnia, Ontario. S don't know which yet. Gonna find out which. Um, I'll probably do that initially just to get rid of the units that are here, fight them off on the American borders, and then I'll probably try and get through... Um, Kingston, if they let any of their fucking units here go. Jesus Christ. Will they? Oh, we'll see what happens, I guess. Worst comes to worst, I'll go up through Montreal. Montreal's a lot easier to take over than the uh, Toronto area, because the Toronto area is just absolutely ridiculous. So, fuck that. That seems to have bucked up our supply a little bit more. Trench there. I'll try to just take that roadway as well. So we'll take over Moose Jaw, then Regina, and then just go down the roadway. I might get units to take over, like, North Battleford and Prince Albert. Not going to bother with, what is this, the pass? Uh, I thought it might be Flin Flon, but apparently it's not. That's Thompson. That is... Pook... Pook... I'm sorry, Pook... Pook I don't even know. What's that one? Gillum. That's Churchill. There's not a lot in Churchill. Search Center, apparently. So, yeah. Our next major city, though, is Winnipeg. Technically, Saskatoon could be a major something because it's got this fucking fabrication, but in all honesty, it's not that... not really anything all too major. We've encountered it many times before. I'm not really worried about it. I'm worried about supply, though. That's something I am definitely worried about. Because despite having the Americans feed us a little bit, we, uh... I appear to be having some supply issues. Let's see if I can build a road and make it happen a little bit. Because we might just have to go up through this way to attack Moose Jaw. Because um, we can't do it any other way. Or we might just have to go and attack Winnipeg first and work backwards. Um, which is definitely something doable. Um, it's not out of the realm of impossibility by any stretch. Did that produce anything there? It did! Load into... Nimitz. Bunch of AAs. They might actually be useful. Um, let's load them some into something. 
So what do we have building currently? We have 10 units total, eight out of eight building. 14 left up there. Uh, North Vancouver obviously is not going to have anything. That one's five days in one day. And Edmonton is 10 days. Okay. Load into Nimitz. Load into Nimitz. What are we at? 3760. Okay. This new wave of units is going to take us down a little bit. I'm just going to send those Marines through that way. Fuck it. Fuck it. I don't care. I don't care. I guess we'll wait for that tank, which is five days. We'll wait for that and then we'll send them off. <laughs> to their death! No, I'm just kidding. It's not their death at all. It's not even close to their death. Yeah, their fucking supply just dropped like a fucking rock. We have nothing there. Well, barely. We have 5%. It's not a lot. When you think about it. Four to five percent supply. Oh, hey, a tank. You're gonna die. I'm not going to let you live. Let's entrench. Um, we have a bit of a problem then, because that's not going to supply at all adequately. Three percent supply is not enough to take a city. I know this by experience. We can try. I don't know if we'll succeed. As soon as they start losing uh, supply, I'm going to get them the fuck out of there, though. Like I said, we'll go through Winnipeg first if we have to. I don't want to, but we might have to. Yes, Ukraine. Sure, Ukraine. Did that produce yet? It did. Load into... Load into... Let's send the Nimitz south. To, what is this, Fort, Fort Bragg? I thought, it was, I thought it was McPherson, but apparently it was not. Hello, Dominican Republic. No, because I want to take you over in the future. Uh, no, why am I looking at all that stuff? Why do I not make anything? I have the... Petrol. Petrol. Apparently. Five days on that. Where's that coming from? Ah, oh, fuck, I should have waited. 14 and 16. Eh, well, fuck it. What am I sitting at? 5,000. That is enough for a new land certification. Yes, sure. Alright, let's experiment here. 2% supply. That is what we have. 2%. This could go disastrously wrong. Oh, I might not do too bad. Yeah, please, send all that shit down. Ah, yes, right, we have support vehicles. I've forgotten about this. Listen, you shit. Listen, you other shit. Hold on. Reserve. No, we lost one. Man down. Man down. Where are you guys fucking going? Repair there. Repair there! Why would you repair in fucking Edmonton? Is it really that? Is it really closer? I didn't think it would be. Pet Federation, sure. Let's go and take... Let's go kill these two. I want to take this fucking city. If I gotta kill every single one of these sons of bitches, I'll do it. And we did it! Moose Jaw's ours! Victory! We're taking some damages, but we're okay. We've we've had worse, that's for sure. So we have two APCs, a Bradley, and a supply truck in the repair. Okay. Are you down there yet? Yeah, yeah, you pretty well is. Let's unload. Send everything north to the Great White North. It's not white yet, but it certainly fucking will be. And we'll 
load you into the supply and we'll wait for the other two as well um, what's producing here 13 days and such that is six and eight so yeah we may as well just wait for those two um, that's 58 that must be fucking close 26 days remaining yeah so that's not too far off what are we at for 1400 okay Wait, what 16 so it's jumping this is supplying problem with this is of course it's still a small village and such so we're gonna have some issues when we go after Brandon hmm I'm not too uh, happy about that but what do you do when you live in a shoe really should have just killed him oh well at least we got rid of most of uh, the mortars all but one mortar I think we got which is good because when we go after Saskatoon that means the bombing won't be as bad so hooray for not having his worse as bad bombs as good. Also, a lot of the supply is going to just explode in on itself after we take Saskatoon and these two towns. Because that's what's feeding this entire area here. Yes, Estonia. We're not allowed. Uh, what is Europe doing exactly? Um, Belarus is gone. Uh, Latvia is fighting the Russians to some minor success. Uh, Poland is fighting the Russians to no success at all. And the Ukrainians are fighting the Russians to... Stalemate, basically. Apparently, Hungary is also still better than Romania. And apparently, Croatia is at war with Bosnia. And Bosnia will never take them over, because Bosnia has, like, two troops. The only way anybody would take them over is if Slovenia intervenes with something. Who are they at war with? Austria. Oh, that's Austria. Oh. Slovenia. Slovenia is at war with Montenegro. That is a very interesting country to be at war with, sir. I don't know why you would have anything against Montenegro. I mean, if you do, that's whatever. That's not my business, but what the fuck? And the French and the Italians and Germans are all at war with each other. Germans are still fighting everybody. Because that's just how the Germans do, apparently. Fighting in the city of Rosendahl town whatever this game calls a town I honestly think of it as a city but I mean I also come from a an area where five three hundred seventy thousand people is quite large considering the next largest city is Montreal but two million people actually I think it might be Quebec yeah Quebec has a little bit more um, keeping in mind that the distance from Halifax to Quebec City is somewhere in the vicinity of eight hours ten hours maybe it's a, it's a long fucking trek I don't recommend it, um, unless you're going across the country. In which case, I, I would I would do it. I hate the people that are like, "Oh, I'm gonna go across Canada," and then they go and they fucking do the whole U.S. thing and they skip over um, stuff. Like I have people, I know people that they're like, "I'm gonna go across Canada," and then they leave, like, you know, whatever St. John, St. John's, Newfoundland. They take the ferry over to Sydney. They come down. They might detour to Halifax to see it. Then they leave and stuff like that. And instead of going up and around and down to uh, Toronto, they go down here through Maine and then across the I-90 into Buffalo and then up into Toronto. I'm sorry, but if you're going to go across the country, you have to go across the actual fucking country. You cannot skip and go into the States. Fuck you. That's not a cross-country trip. That's a mild vacation by car. That's what that is. You dumb fucks. Anyway. Back to what I was doing, taking over the city of Regina. Did those units repair yet? Apparently there's only two in repair. Oh. They're not far from bitten, getting all gooded up. Gooded up. That is a word I just used. Aha. Load into supply. Load into supply? Wow. That supply can fit a lot of units. Let's send these guys south. You just got deployed. Shut up phone. I don't care. You're not my friend. Ever. Seriously, who the fuck is calling? There, I muted the damn ringer. Fucking thing. 
tell you, it's annoying as shit. Technically, I could send my units via land now. Why don't I? Why don't I do that? There is supply, very little, but there is enough supply to get them down here. I don't technically need to be sending them by boat anymore. Although I, I guess, I don't know. I keep forgetting that because we've just done it for so long. Feels like it's routine. Oh, dude, there's a grizzly. Fuck you, you're not allowed to live. In fact, the fact that you're alive insults me. Oh, he's dead. It doesn't insult me anymore. So, we took over Regina. Now we have to worry about taking over Saskatoon, which will be all kinds of fun. Also, you can see the supplies just leaving the area as I speak. Jesus Christ. Um, let's go up here and trench. That supply must be pretty close or not. Wow. Slow ass. The Nimitz would have been here by now. That's why I love the Nimitz more than you. Oh, your parents never loved you. Yes, Romania? Sure, Romania. Why not? I can get it on that. What's that town supplying it? Grand Prairie. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm too lazy to take Grand Prairie, unless I can just use the Marines. I should just use the Marines. What's he going for? Excuse me. Um, let's send him back up north. Let's take Inuvik. For no reason. Maybe it'll make them surrender. They'll give up now that they don't have Inuvik. I don't think that would ever be the case. I'm pretty sure we'd just be like, why did you take Inuvik? There's so much more you could have taken in Canada, and you took Inuvik. You dense fucker. I'd be like, well, that's just not very nice. It's quite rude, actually. I... No. Um, I'm going to bomb the crap out of Saskatoon when I'm ready to attack it. Because if I bomb the crap out of it now, they're just going to recover. And that that's just a problem. I don't want them to recover. I want them to be detrimental to their health. You, you can come here. So is he actually doing that? Wow, he's gonna go like across that way. Why would you go that way? So doesn't make any sense, like at all. Oh, whatever. Whatever he wants to do, it's his life. Now, where are they going to start bombing? There, they're going to start bombing me. Okay. Alright, let's bring in the hot shots. This could be interesting. I don't want to watch. I'm going to look up here. Oh, good. Two more. I can literally just send them south. Because I have that ability. I wish there was more supply, but, I mean, you know, you got to work with what you got, so... You know, that's what we're doing. Working with what we have. And that guy must be there by now, yep. So, load. Nah, nah, nah. Oh, apparently we just fucking destroyed everything. Because that's just how we do. So, now all we have to do is annihilate Saskatoon. It is Saskatoon, yes. And then we take over another land fabrication. And an aer aerospace fabrication. Fuck you, man. Oh, shit. Don't you fucking kill him. I'll be angry. You, don't, you won't like me when I'm angry. Go repair over there. Oh, shit, what's that? <gasps> tanks, 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 tanks. Kill the tanks. Tank, tank, tanks. Kill the tankies. Both tanks. No tank can live while the other survives. Harry Potter 2012. Was it 20? When did that movie come out? I'm slightly concerned that my dates are wrong. Are we going to have to take over that oil gas fabrication too? Because I feel that's something that's going to have to happen. Fucking tanks. Where are they getting all these tanks? In my recollection, Canada did not have this many. You should just take that while you're at it. 
Why not? Let's just destroy everything they've ever loved. Yeah, there you go. So they're not nah, supply is going to take a hit to the friggin' balls because it's all the supply they had. Let's get back down to Regina. We can fight the now assembling troops of Canada. Where are you going? Oh, they're going to try and take that over. Douchebags. You can't do that. I love how they don't really bother to fight back. They're just kind of like, oh, well, we're going to die. Almost makes me sad. Everybody go and do the resupply. Yeah. A tank. No tank. Is there anything else? No, that's a tank. Our next big goal is Winnipeg. But that will be probably next episode. Because... Because Winnipeg. That's why. And because... I have things to do, unfortunately. I do have somewhat of a life. I know that's hard to uh, conceive, but there is something resembling a life that I do have and that I have to do. So, yeah, got to do that. So thank you very much for watching this episode. He's still going for that, and next episode he will take that. I know that's what you're waiting for, is him to take over Grand Prairie, but uh, you're going to have to wait. Unfortunately. <laughs> uh, thank you much for watching, guys. I will see you all next time. Oh, we're not going to scrap that. We're going to deactivate it. Peace.